Hello children, in mathematics geometry plays vital role. In geometry we do come across many theorems, results and relationships. Today we shall perform an activity which verifies the relationship between the areas of similar triangles and their corresponding sides. For that we take some pair of triangles. Here you can see these two triangles and here you can see these two triangles. Children, now we shall verify whether these triangles are similar or not. Now I am taking these two triangles. Here we have triangle A, B, C and here we have triangle D, E, F. Now I am placing this angle A over angle D. It is clear that these two angles are equal. Now I am placing angle C over angle F. These two angles are equal. Now I am placing angle B over angle F. These two angles are equal. So children, we have seen that the corresponding angles are equal. So these two triangles are similar due to AAA similarity. Now we will check regarding their areas. The statement is the ratio of the areas of two similar triangles is equal to the ratio of squares of their corresponding sides. Now we see their areas and their corresponding sides. Children, if you take two similar triangles, the side AC and DF are corresponding and the side AB and DE are corresponding and the side BC and EF are corresponding. Now we check their areas. For checking this relation, I am taking one unit triangle of our convenient sides. Now unit triangle means the area of this triangle is one square unit. I am labeling it as A. B, C. Now here we have a triangle ABC. Now I am taking four replicas of this triangle. Here replica means these triangle are congruent. I am arranging like this. Now, I am labeling it as D, E, F. Now see, we will verify whether the triangle ABC and triangle D, E, F are similar or not. Since these two triangles are replicas of unit area triangle, hence these two triangles are similar triangles. Now we check their areas. The area of the triangle ABC is one square unit and the area of the triangle DEF is four square units because it, it is made up of four unit triangles. The area of triangle ABC is one square unit and the area of triangle DEF is equal to four square units. Now we find the ratio of area of triangle ABC and area of triangle DEF. It is 1 is to 4. Now we see the sides. The side of BC of triangle ABC is 1 unit and the corresponding side EF of triangle DEF is 2 units. The ratio of corresponding sides is 1 is to 2 and square of the ratio is 1 square is to 2 square is equal to 1 is to 4. From these two results, it is verified that the ratios of the areas of similar triangles is equal to the ratio of square of their corresponding sides. Now we will verify by using 9 such unit triangles. Now I am taking this triangle DEF and I am making 
another triangle Now, the triangle is made by using 9 such unit triangles. I am labeling it as G H I. Now, we see whether it the result is verified on these two triangles. Now, these two triangles are similar because angle E is equal to angle H, angle D is equal to angle G angle F is equal to angle I because these are all the replicas of the unit triangles. Now, we see the areas. Area of triangle D E F is equal to totally 1, 2, 3, 4 means 4 square units. Now, area of triangle G H I is equal to 9 square units ratio of the areas is equal to 4 is to 9. Now, we see the sides. We take the side EF here, their corresponding side HI here. Side EF in triangle DEF is equal to 2 units. Side HI in triangle GHI is equal to 3 unit. Ratio of corresponding sides is equal to 2 is to 3. Square of corresponding sides ratio is equal to 2 square is to 3 square is equal to 4 is to 9. From these two results, results 1 and 2 shows us that the ratio of the areas is equal to ratios of squares of their corresponding sides. Children, I have verified by taking one unit triangle and four unit triangles and nine unit triangles. Similarly, you can take 25 such unit triangles and verify the results. Hope you have understood. Thank you.